And, you know, I guess something that would affect your mental health would be having your SUV stolen, <laughs> such as what happened. Yeah, it would, it would affect mine. Uh, yeah, right. Like the, the rapper Akon. I don't know if you're familiar with Akon, Ann. Uh, yeah. He, yeah. So he had his SUV stolen while pumping gas in Atlanta. Uh, now, police did use the Find My iPhone app to recover it. There are no suspects at this time. But uh, what we do know for now is that I hope this criminal, cue the music, Anne, gets locked up. Locked up. They won't let me out. Yeah. They won't let me out. Get to jail, criminal. They won't let me out. Yeah, you're not going to be let out. Akon, A- Akon wrote a song about you specifically, so you're not getting out anytime soon once you get locked up. I hope he, yeah. Oh, God. I've had, a car, I've had my car stolen before. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's stop the show. Uh, can you please tell us this story? It was years ago, and um, it was a truck, and uh, yeah, someone stole it. And then my, I was married at the time, and then my husband and I, we, we went out looking for the truck. I don't know what we were thinking, but it had new tires on it. It was like a vintage 70 Chevy pickup. So we thought, well, maybe someone stole it for the, you know, for the tires. I don't know. Anyway, we went looking for it, and we found the guy driving um, the truck. And oh so we God. went, we chased him for a while, and then we lost him because it was just getting too dangerous. And then the next morning, whoever stole a truck brought it back and left it in front of the house. What? And it, and it had more gas in it than before. <laughs> and then get this. So it was just this weird thing that happened. And then um, the story got out. This guy was writing a – he had this column in the newspaper where he just kind of wrote odd little things that happened in town. And so he wrote about it, and he wrote how it was brought back. And then the guy was bragging to someone like, yeah, that article's about me. I stole that truck. And he got busted. Oh, my God. The police went yeah. Okay, I'm so confused because we're talking about a criminal, but he's also kind of a generous criminal because he filled your gas tank for you and he gave it back. I mean, what? The- well, no, I think he was worried that we knew where he lived. Oh, because I mean, yeah. how weird! You steal it all of a sudden. You're you know, after you steal a vehicle, you're driving the vehicle, and then someone's following you. And you're like, holy moly! Yeah. You know? Um, so I think, yeah, he thought we knew where he lived. And so he was just going to bring it back before we came yeah. and was arrested. But too late, too late. He was caught and now, uh, he's in jail for, I mean, is he still in jail? How long ago was this? No, no, it was years ago. I don't even know what happened to him. Huh. Interesting. All right. Well, you know what? Oh, he got he got um, charged with joyriding because it wasn't car theft because he brought it back. Yeah, yeah. So, so yeah, he took, he's like, you know what? Hey, let me take this car that's not mine. Let me fill it up, you know, with gas, so it doesn't really <laughs> seem like stealing. And then, oh my God, wow, they might know where I live. Let me bring it back, and then everything's gonna be okay. And then, of course, the cops show that's up. That's what happened. Oh boy. Well. You- 